Please don't be my bank account. I really don't need him to see how broke I am. My hand? Wait, which one? Oh, okay, guess it's this one then. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be weird. I don't know what to wear. Okay, very funny genius, but I have class today, so no. Oh, actually, this could work. <gasps> Are you kidding me? Okay, that was pretty cute, so I guess I won't be mad at him, but he owes me a new lipstick. Does anyone know the answer to letter A? No, I don't. Yes? Um, 22? Correct. Good job. Hey, beautiful. What do you say you come with me? Don't be scared. Come on. <laughs> I just knocked somebody out. Or, I guess you did. Okay, yeah, I should probably go. Morning. I just wanted to say thank you for protecting me like that yesterday. So, I guess you can hear and see everything that I do? Well, guess I'll take that as a yes. <laughs> hey, would you stop that? Hey, Mia. Hi. I, uh, I like your dress. Oh, thanks. Can I have your snap? Yeah, sure, it's... Are you... are you good? Yeah, sorry about that. Why don't I just add you? Okay, my username is... What the... Actually, never mind. That was so embarrassing. Moo! Ow! Oh, I barely even pushed... <gasps> I am so sorry. Do you know how much this outfit was? No. Of course you don't, you idiot! Did you just- No, I- Zip it! You are gonna pay for my dry cleaning! Why are you so aggressive? I'm just trying to look out for you. Well, please tone it down, because you're gonna get me in trouble. On my way! We're gonna party hard tonight! I am so excited. Okay, I'll be waiting. Come on, girl, let's go! Um... <laughs> Let go of the door. I can't. Oh, I see what you're doing. No, I'm being serious. My soulmate, he's- Save it. You should have told me you didn't want to come. No, Sarah, wait. Thanks for wasting my gas. You know, I thought I asked you to tone it down. I don't need you to be acting like a, a parent to me. This is getting really annoying. When do I get to control him? Want to switch and control your soulmate? Yes. You will control your soulmate's hand with your mind. You will now be able to see and hear everything your soulmate does. Some things will be censored for privacy reasons. Oh, that's a relief. Are you ready to switch now? Yes. She's in control of me now? Great! Just don't do anything dirty. <gasps> ah! Jeez, I was just kidding! Oh, this is so fun. Ready for the concert? I sure am. Who is she? Oh, no, he doesn't. Whoa! You good? Oh, I'm fine. <laughs> Chill, this is my sister. Whoops. Damn, and I thought I was overprotective. Sorry, I guess we both kind of are. <laughs> Why do we have to switch back? Oh, please, just be anything but my hand. Seriously? Listen, I just got a new job, and I cannot have you messing it up for me, okay? Hi, welcome to Happy Burger. How may I take your order? Get me a cheeseburger. Okay, and would you like a side of fries with that? No, no thank you. Hey, I said no fries. I am so sorry, ma'am. Let me fix that for you right now. Jerk. Excuse me, are you talking to me? No, ma'am, not you. Here is your food, ma'am, and I am very sorry for the misunderstanding. You should be fired. <gasps> How dare you! No, ma'am, I am so sorry. That was not me. I am gonna go speak to the manager, you weirdo. No, <laughs> ma'am, please wait. Hand over your equipment. Please, don't fire me. Okay, maybe I won't if you, uh, do me a little favor. Hey, yo, you see that nerd right there? I bet you 500 bucks you can't get her a date for the prom. 500? All right, bet, bro, you're on. Okay, but if you lose, you owe me 500. Hey, excuse me? Yeah? 
Please tell me you got two options today. Yeah, I did. But what's it to you? Just tell me what they are, please. I got the option to be smart or be beautiful, but I haven't picked one yet, because I can't decide. Pick to be beautiful. Excuse me? Uh, I just mean you're already the smartest girl here, so I would just pick to be beautiful if I were you. <laughs> you really think that I should? Oh, yeah. Wow. Well, okay. Nothing's changed. Oh, man. Maybe the system's broken. I think it's still loading. But prom's in two days. Yeah, so? Listen, how would you like to go on a little shopping spree with me? You barely even talk to me. Why would you want to take me- I want to be your friend. Come on. Well, my mom does say I need to make more friends. So? Fine. But just so you know, my mom has installed a chip in the back of my head so she can track me wherever I go. Okay. I'm just saying in case you're trying to kidnap me. Uh-huh. Can I see those glasses? Sure, but they're a little busted. And now they're completely busted. Why would you- Chill, chill out. I'll get you something better. But I can't see without my glasses. And that's the bell. Follow me. What does your beauty option say? I would tell you what it said, but I can't see because you broke my glasses. I told you I'm gonna buy you contacts, but first we gotta fix that unibrow. I'm gonna pluck a few hairs, okay? No way. Come on, I'm just trying to help you out. I'm gonna make your eyebrows look snatched. It won't hurt too bad, right? Nah, we're just plucking a few little hairs. Ow! Okay, that was a big one. Please tell me you're done. I'm done, and it's looking good. Yikes, I can do eyebrows, but not hair. Time for a professional makeover. A makeover? Yeah, you know, like in those teen movies. It'll be fun. I don't know. Don't be a negative Nancy. Come on, we're going to the mall. I won't even be able to see where I'm going. Just hold my hand, and I'll guide you around. Hey, it's okay. You can trust me. I'll buy you contacts once we get there. Let's go. Those should be your prescription. Can you see? Yeah. Perfect. Now try these on. Remind me again why we're doing this. Uh, I'm just trying to be a good friend to you. That's all. Okay, that top is the one. Now we just gotta get you some hair and makeup to go with it. I will be your hair and makeup artist. Come with me. Are you ready to see her? Yes, ma'am. Let him see, honey. Holy shit. She looks, uh, beautiful. Now you have my number. Call me for prom. Bye. How do you feel? I feel... different. Hopefully it's a good different, because next we gotta get you a date to the prom. Why don't I just go with you? Oh, actually, I was planning on asking this other girl, so, uh... Right, of course. But hey, listen, you deserve better than me. You know how to flirt, right? Well, sure I do. Okay, let's go over a few things then. First off, guys kinda like it when girls, you know, play with their hair. Like this? Oh boy, we got some work to do. Okay, let's try a subtle lip bite. Uh, no, don't do that. Try again. You know what, never mind. Okay, pretend to ask me to prom. Go to prom with me. Ow. Okay, let's try asking and not grabbing so hard. Sorry. Hey, will you go to the prom with me? Alright, that was perfect. If you stare at a guy like that with your eyes, he'll be <clears throat> mesmerized, yeah. I should probably get back home. Yeah, for sure. Hey Jake, guess what? I got someone to go to the prom with me. Really? Who? Him. Sup, Jake? Bet you didn't see this coming. Here's your 500 bucks, Jake. I guess you won the bet. I didn't think I'd be the one taking her on a date, but damn, she's hot now. I mean, she was already kind of cute. Eh, well, I just want a hot date. After prom, I'm gonna dump her. What? She'll get over it. I'll talk to you later. Hey, can we talk for a second? What's up? I can't let you go to the prom with him. You can't go to prom with him. What? Why not? Don't mess with my prom date, Jake. I'm not gonna let you use her. Me? You're the one that's been using her. What is he talking about? I was just trying to help you look nice because... Because I made him a bet. A bet? Yep, that you couldn't get a date to the prom. Listen, I know that sounds bad, but... I thought you said you were helping me so you could be my friend. I... You were just using me for money. No. I'm sorry, I should Get away from me. And to think I actually liked... Layla. Never talk to me again. Forget them, and forget the system. I was beautiful before this makeover, and I'm beautiful now. Maybe this option wasn't supposed to make me beautiful. It was supposed to show me that I already am. But I think for prom, maybe I won't wear the glasses. And you know what? I don't need any guy to go with. I'm going on my own. Hey, Layla. What you doing? Walking to my Uber. Uber? I told you I'm taking you to prom. And I told you I'm not going with you to prom anymore. I'm going alone. That's not gonna happen. <laughs> Let go! Get in my car. Mom, I can't do this anymore. I'm only 16. I, I can't handle her by myself. I have to put her up for adoption.
coming. Hi, my name is Emily. I was wondering if you wanted to buy some chocolate. Aren't you a little young to be selling stuff by yourself? Where's your mom? I, I ran away from my foster mommy. <sighs> you ran away? Oh, she's probably looking for you. Okay, here, um, come inside. All right, well, I think I better call the police. What are you looking at? That little freckle you have right there. My daughter had the same one on her face. Oh my gosh, I think you might be my kid. You're my real mommy? You know what, I shouldn't have said that out loud. I don't know that for sure, but please don't make me go back to my foster mom. She's really mean. Please don't bring me back to my foster mom. Sweetheart, I... Hi, I'm looking for a little girl. She has brown hair and brown eyes, and... Please, don't let her take me. Oh my gosh, Emily. <sighs> I'm sorry, she runs off a lot. Oh, does she? Well, she came to my house trying to sell me some chocolates. She, she makes me sell them. Oh boy, here we go again with the stories. I'm so sorry. But, but... Emily, do you want to time out? <gasps> no, no, please. Then tell her you're sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. All right, Emily, it's time to go. Tell her. Tell her that you're my real mommy. I... Emily, we're leaving. Come visit me. My address is 2122 Maplewood. No, wait. I found her house. You know, I think she is my daughter. And I think I want her back. I am so sorry to bother you. And this is going to sound kind of crazy, but I think that Emily um, might be my daughter. And why do you think that? Well, about five years ago, I gave my daughter up for adoption, and how old is Emily? She's five. I see, and it's not just that. She also has a freckle in the same spot that my daughter had one. So you think that she's your daughter because of a freckle on <sighs> her face? Well, when you put it like that, it sounds- Look, I don't have time for this. No, please wait. I, I'm just asking for a DNA test. I don't have the funds for that. Oh no, I would cover all of the expenses. And if she is your daughter, do you plan on taking her back? Well. Yes, I do. And what if she isn't? Then I guess I would have to leave her with you then. <sighs> Fine, I'll allow it. She did great, and we should have the results in 48 hours. Hi, is this Miss Monroe? I'm calling from the doctor's office regarding your DNA test. Wow, that was fast, and yes it is. So, according to our test, it looks like Emily is not your biological <sighs> child. Are you... are you sure? Yes, ma'am. I'm so sorry. I hate to be the bearer of bad news. No, it's... it's okay. So what'd they say? Emily, I just want to tell you that I think that you're a great kid. And I am so sorry for getting your hopes up. What do you mean? Oh, I knew it. You're not a biological mother, are you? Are you? No, I'm not. No, please don't leave me here. You are my mommy. I know it. I hope you're happy with yourself. Hello? Hi, is this Miss Monroe? We're calling regarding your DNA test. Yes, it is, but you guys have already called me. No, ma'am, I think you're mistaken. We just got your results in a few hours ago. What? And it does look like Emily is your biological child. Emily, it's me. Is anyone home? This is ridiculous. Where are they? That looked like Emily in the back seat. Where is she taking her? No, listen to me. You don't understand. I am telling you that she is in danger. Again, ma'am, you don't know that for sure. And we can't do anything until she's been missing for a total of 24 hours. You know, if they're not going to help me, I'm going to find her myself. Hi, excuse me. Um, have you seen a little girl that looks like this? No, I have not. I'm sorry. It's all right. It's the foster mom. But where is Emily? Hey. Ah, you scared me. Good. Now, where's my daughter? Good Lord. Didn't we just establish that she's not your daughter? She is my daughter, and I think you and I both know that. You had someone send a fake phone call to me, didn't you? <laughs> you can't prove anything. Where is she? She's with a new foster family now. What? You gave her to a new family? She was too much for me to handle. I had to transfer her. Where? No, no. That is confidential information. You better tell me right now or I'll- Don't you dare threaten me. You're the one who gave her up in the first place. So if you want to be mad at anyone, why didn't you go look in the mirror? Why would she fake that phone call if she wanted to get rid of Emily anyways? Wait. 
Well, she came to my house trying to sell me some chocolates. She, she makes me sell them. I don't think that she gave her up. I think she wants to keep her and use her to make money. Let go of me. Emily, that is enough. It's time for bed. I want my real mom. She's gone. Open up, ma'am. This is the police. The child is not on the bottom floor. Shh, guys, I heard something. Yeah. <sighs> Emily! Emily! Get her to room 203. Ma'am, you cannot be in here. Please, I, I just want to know what's wrong with her. She's very dehydrated. Do you know how long she was in that closet for? No, I, I don't. This is all my fault. I should have cut to her sooner. Excuse me. Your daughter is awake now. You can come and see her. Mommy. Hi, sweetheart. <laughs> What's wrong? I thought you left me. <laughs> Emily, I promise you, I am never going to leave you again, okay? No, my foster mom's going to come back. <gasps> hey, hey, it's okay. Listen, your foster mom is not coming back. I'm going to take care of you from now on. <laughs> promise? I promise. Now, you get some rest, okay, honey? Okay. Excuse me, Miss Monroe, there's a Daniel Knight here to see you. What? Mm-hmm, he's claiming to be the father of Emily. Daniel? Hey, how is she? How did you know we were here? Are you kidding? You and her are all over the news. How is she? Let me go see her. Whoa, whoa, hang on a second. You took off the day that she was born because you didn't realize how difficult raising a kid would be. Look, I, I was 16, okay? So was I, and you left me alone with her. You know, if you didn't leave, I probably wouldn't have given her up in the first place. Oh, so you're saying this is all my fault? No, that's not what I'm saying. I just don't think right now is a good time for you to see her. She's been through enough shock. Please, Allie. No, you don't get to do that. You don't get to just walk back in here and start being her parent again. Isn't that what you did? <sighs> no, that was different. How? Face it, we're in the same boat here. We both made mistakes. You had a chance to fix yours. Now it's my turn. The doctor said she's going to be okay. She just needs to sleep. Wow. She's... She's beautiful. She definitely got her looks from you. This week is important, kids. Because our scales appeared. Yes, since this is you and your brother's 18th birthday week, we'll finally get to find out how evil you two are. I already know. Mine's going straight to villain. Of course it is, darling. Your last name isn't Menace for nothing. Oh, I can just see the headlines now. Mindy Menace, world's greatest supervillain. We got you suits. <gasps> yes, sweet. I know, but you can't wear them until your birthday. Huh? Why not? You're not a true villain until the scale says so. My suit better be flame proof. Yeah, and mine better handle ice. Mindy, Max, don't worry. They do. Can I get a cape? No, no, no cape. Hey, how'd your scale go up? Oh, I took your credit card when you weren't looking. I hope you don't mind. I got a couple things. Oh. Ow! Ha, huh, that's what you get. Whoa, chill! I've got a plan, and you're gonna want to hear about it. I know a way we can move our scales a lot. I'm listening. See that bank? Yeah. Well, you and I are gonna rob it. Oh, alright. Sounds good to me. And look what I got. Our suits, but Mom and Dad said we're not supposed to- Wear them to... until our birthdays. I know, but we gotta prove to them that we can be real villains. You know what? You're right. Wait, Max, what should our villain names be? Huh, how about I'm Frost and you're Blaze? Okay, not bad, Max. Let's do this. Everybody freeze. Do what he says or else you're going to get barbecued. Oh. Fry the safe. On it. Money, here we come. <laughs> Whoa, look at all that cash. Not so fast. Careful, he's a super. What's your name? I'm Witherstorm. <laughs> nice. Why do they call you that? Allow me to demonstrate. Looks like Weather Boy can control Mother Nature. Blaze, get him. With pleasure. I don't think so.
like him. I do not. Uh-uh. You think he's cute, don't you? No. As your twin, I can tell you're lying. Are you guys gonna argue this whole time? What the hell is this place? Your worst nightmare. Max. So, your real name's Max, huh? <sighs> what? That must be my new gadget. Be right back. Why can't I use my powers? Sorry, but that bracelet on your wrist, it's a power dampener. I need you to set me free. And why is that? There's a tornado headed towards my family's house, and I'm the only one with the powers to stop it. Yeah, right. You really think I'm that stupid? I'm serious. Come on. I can see good in you. Please, you have to release me. Where is he? He, he escaped. Your scale. You let him free. I'm telling mom and dad. No, Max, wait. Stay there. Wait, mom, dad. Our lie detector arrived in the mail. Now tell us, did you set the hero free? No. Scanning. Lie detected. Mindy. I told you. Look, I'm sorry. It was only so he could protect his family. Plus, he promised he would owe me a favor in return. Mindy, that's enough. You are turning into a superhero. She sure has a crush on one. I do not. Listen very carefully. We don't date superheroes in this family. You're gonna get rid of him. Understand? Now remember, if you don't complete the mission, don't come home. I saw you from down the street. You're not here to cause any trouble, are you? I'm sorry, Sam. How do you know my real name? My parents did some digging on you. Enough talk! Ugh. You brought your brother with you? We're kind of a team. Stop! You're better than this! Shut up! My sister is a villain. Okay, Max, that's enough. Why aren't you fighting back? Because I... I don't want to hurt you. Huh, how pathetic. Finish him. No, I won't. You were right, Max. I... I do care about him. What? Ugh, I knew it. You've gone soft. You're almost a superhero. And you're in love with one. Well, who says heroes and villains can't like each other? No, you have to make a choice. Our family or him. Max. I'm serious, Mindy. Pick one. Fine, then I choose him. How dare you! Knock it off. Nah, you're about to become a hero, which makes you my enemy. You want to know why I chose him over this family? Yeah, why? Because he's the only one that's ever been nice to me. Nice? We're a family of villains. We're not nice. You always were the weaker twin. <sighs> you leave her alone right now! Aw, uh, look who's up. What are you going to do, huh? Simple. I'm going to create your biggest weakness. Extreme heat. No, stop. Ugh. Hero. I knew you were a hero, Mindy! Remember when you said you would owe me a favor? Do you think I could stay at your house? My parents will never let me come home now. Of course. My family is going to love you. Four mil or a hair clip? Come on, who in their right mind would choose the- Achoo! No! <laughs> at least it's kind of cute. I can't come to your party. But you promised. I know, I'm so sorry. <sighs> come on, girl, you're like the mutual friend. If you don't come, then no one else is gonna wanna come. Look, my parents said no. She doesn't wanna come to your party because she doesn't like you. You sure that's the reason? Yes, I wouldn't lie, okay? Goodbye. Mom says you have to take me to the mall. She's lying. Your mom just grounded her. Mom just grounded you. How did you know that? You weren't even home when it happened. I don't know. I just did, okay? Now get out. Oh, whatever. Does this hair clip tell me the truth about people? Hey babe, I'm sorry. I'm not gonna be able to make it to our date tonight. What? Why not? Something came up at work. It's urgent. Babe, you work at Walmart. Like, how urgent can it really be? Sorry babe, I gotta go. He doesn't work for Walmart. Hey babe, I'm sorry. I'm not gonna be able to make it to our date tonight. What? Why not? Something came up at work. It's urgent. Babe, you work at Walmart. Like, how urgent can it really be? Sorry, babe. I gotta go. He doesn't work for Walmart. If he doesn't work for Walmart, then where does he... I'm following him. What is he doing here? This place looks super sketchy. What do you think you're doing, huh? Come here. Hey, boss, look who I found snooping around here. Babe, what, what is going on? Babe, you know this girl? I've never seen her before in my life. I'm sorry, did our two years together just mean nothing to you? 
two years. Have you been keeping secrets from me? I told you, you know what the rules are. He's trying to protect you by lying. He works for very dangerous men. You know what, my bad. Actually, I thought that he was my boyfriend, but- Be quiet. What did I tell you? No attachments. Which means no girlfriends. Like I said, I don't know her. Okay, good. Then you should have no problem killing her. He's lying to protect you. You know what, my bad. Actually, I thought that he was my boyfriend, but- Be quiet. What did I tell you? No attachments. Which means no girlfriends. Like I said, I don't know her. Okay, good. Then you should have no problem killing her. <laughs> you see, sir, I would kill her, but you know, I don't want to mess up this new shirt, so... Either you kill her, or him and I will do it ourselves. No, please. Look, let's just all settle down. You just... I think I'm gonna need a change of clothes. Really, babe? The Mafia? You're lucky I find that kind of attractive. Well, I know a place we can lay low. I bet, but we gotta be careful who we trust. I have something that can help with that. Babe, I got- Don't you dare use any more of those words, understand? Five million words? That's ridiculous. You won't be using any of those. I'm- What did I tell you about talking? I'm breaking up with you. Oh, really? Where are you gonna go? You don't have any money. Nine million words this year, huh? No one needs that many. Hey, I need you to go to the store for me. I don't like that pink shirt you bought yesterday. I want you to return it. You're allowed to use three words maximum when you go out. Don't be playing games with me this time. I'll be checking your words when you get back. Hi, what would you like to return? Just that? Okay, hold on one second. That'll be $6.99 back on the card. Please help me. Please help me. Oh, uh, did you need my help finding something in the store, or...? Hey, can we hurry up the line? I'm on my lunch break. I don't got all day. Do you need medical attention? No. Hey, it's okay. Can you wait over there for me, hun, and I'll get someone to help you? You're allowed to use three words maximum when you go out. Don't be playing games with me this time. I'll be checking your words when you get back. I'm so sorry. The line is really busy right now, but my manager will be over here to help you soon. There you are. You took forever. Did you return the shirt? Good, let's get out of here. Damn, why do I feel like I'm forgetting to do something? Wait a minute. You were supposed to make dinner tonight. Go on. What? Is dinner ready? Hey, 8,996? You used an extra word, and you're gonna tell me why. You used an extra word, and you're gonna tell me why. Go on, talk. Explain yourself. It was an accident. I was just telling the cashier thanks. Uh-huh. You sure about that? Yes, I swear. You should really have your dinner. It's getting cold. That's enough talking out of you. Go to sleep. Bed, now. How did you make that chicken? Why? Because after I ate it, my head is filling. <sighs> my phone is dead and his is locked away. I have to get the charger. Please hurry up. <gasps> yes. 911, what's your emergency? I need help. Thank you for the information, ma'am. Officers will arrive shortly. You. You thought you could get away with putting something in my food? Your words. Why did you use up so many? Actually, don't speak. I'll mm. find out. You can't outsmart me. <sighs> Sir, step away from the girl. Let's see your hands. Looks like I just did. No. 